What's up everybody? Welcome to the review of the Flix brushes. I know, I know, I know it has been a really, really, really long time that between the announcement that I wanted to make a uh, test about them, I will link that video down in the description and here as well, and the time where I thought I make a video about the test or testing out those wires is very long. There are several reasons, but I don't want to go into the detail because the video will be too long. But now it's time to check them out and test them out on a video. But before I do it, I encourage you out there to subscribe to the channel. So please subscribe to the channel, click the subscribe button, click the bell so you can't miss any video out that I will produce in the next days. All right, back to the brushes. The uh, first thing that I want to show you is the different thicknesses of the different uh, fibers that we have here on those brushes. So the blue ones are, I would say, double as thick as the red ones. And I will test now out if that makes any difference in the sound because the red ones are for low volumes and the blue ones are for the louder volumes and should have also a different sound. So I will check that out. So we have here first the red one. Which sounds very low in volume, even when I play it a bit hard, but it sounds very nice in the low volume setting. Now I have the blue one and it is louder, but the sound is also much more brighter than the red ones because those thick fibers that are on those brushes here produce a very bright, loud, nice sound on that symbol. Very cool. So how do you push those wires into the brushes where you, with one hand, you put your four fingers on the um, part of the brush here and then you push it in like that or you push it out like that and then you can change the position of the wires like that so you have a small amount of wires or you have a large amount of wires depending how you want the length of the wires and naturally with two hands it goes faster but i don't have now the possibilities to film that with two hands so i just made it with one hand cool feature of the red brushes is the ascent part here so when you play them like this you can use the butt end of the wires to Play that on the cymbal. I also made a video about that on my channel. I will put it in the description box below and here as well. So now it's time to go into the handling quality of those wires. And I can say I give them a 10 out of 10 because the handling quality is really, really good. And 
Now I show you some styles that we can use with those wonderful wires. All right, you have seen some really nice styles that I have played with those brushes. And uh, generally, I am really happy with those brushes. They feel good, they have good playing and handling quality. The feel when I play them is pretty good. So I really like them and um, yeah, that is Really cool to play with those brushes and uh, yeah, they're cool. They're really cool. All right, see you next time. Bye-bye.